so in slideshow uh, there will be a uh, slide uh, slides and your voice will be there and uh, for that uh, so firstly just uh, ensure that there are no other sources uh, you can remove those sources by clicking on this minus button now uh, let's add uh, image slideshow so click on this plus button and click on image slideshow click ok so here scroll down and click on plus so there are two options add files or a directory so if you have all the image uh, slides in a directory you can select add directory or you can add manually by clicking on add files so just remember one point here uh, this will not uh, take powerpoint slides as its input so you will have to convert uh, those uh, powerpoint slides into images before uploading here so let's click on this add file so these are my slides in the form of images uh, I will select these five slides and click on OK you can check the sequence if it is correct or not otherwise you can move it uh, upward in direct direction by using these two keys so uh, let's click on OK uh, you can resize it you can see the slide is moving automatically and if I click on this start recording the video will start and uh, the slides will move automatically and you, will, you can speak so that will get recorded but uh, in general we want that the slide should in our control and if we click uh, any button on keyboard then it should move forward or backwards so we will have to assign key uh, for that so let's uh, first remove this automatic portion automatic setting so uh, I am going to click or select this and uh, or you can right click and click on properties now you can see uh, here uh, the slide mode slide mode is automatically so you can click on manual uh, okay one more thing if it is automatically you can change the speed by uh, changing these values 800 transition time between slides and transition speed so you can change the values and you can um, control the speed of slide movement but uh, but we want it to be manual so we will have to click on this manual so you can see the here that use hotkeys to control slide sheet so we will have to assign some hotkey for that and uh, this is there is a uh, checkbox also for loop so if you want that uh, after the last slide uh, the first slide, the slide should begin then you can click on this checkbox otherwise you can deselect it if you don't want it to be in a loop so click on ok now we, uh, you can see the slide is not moving so we will have to assign hotkeys for the slide movement so click on file settings hotkeys scroll down in this image slideshow you can see this next slide so select this and now uh, listen carefully click uh, right arrow key on keyboard right arrow key on keyboard so right arrow key on keyboard is assigned uh, for forward slide movement for a previous slide select this one and click on backward arrow key on the keyboard so that's it so we have assigned two keys left and right arrow key for forward and backward movement of slideshow click on ok now uh, if I click right uh, arrow key then it will the slide will move forward and if I click on backward arrow key the slide will move backward now we can start our recording click on start recording 
and now you can speak about these slides and you can control the movement by move uh, clicking on forward arrow key or backward arrow key uh, stop recording let's see our uh, recording start recording and now you can speak about these slides and you can control the movement by move uh, clicking on forward arrow key so this is the recording you can see uh, this is a slideshow uh, recording